Hey guys, here we are going through our first set of questions on differentiation from first principles. Now, if you are watching this in the old coronavirus crisis, you may not, then you might not have even seen this yet. If that's the case, I'm putting a link in the description to one of my older videos walking you through what this is, where it comes from, and some work examples. So, go check that out first, then come back and do these. Let's go. Okay, now just quickly for the questions, I've also put the first principles formula in the PDF. You are all given this in your exams, so you don't need to remember it, but we certainly need to know how to use it. So, uh, let's do that. Okay then, first up, proof from first principles that the derivative of 3x squared is 6x. Alright, first up then, we need to define the function. So, let f of x equal 3x squared. But next, we need f of x plus h. So the x becomes x plus h. So this is 3 lots of x plus h all squared. So that's three lots of x squared add two x h add h squared uh, which is then three x squared add 6xh add 3h squared Okay So now we can start putting the fraction together Not going to worry about the derivative or the limit yet So f of x plus h minus f of x all over h is going to be 3x squared add 6xh add 3h squared minus f of x so minus 3x squared all over h. Now the 3x squared cancel, so we are left with 6xh add 3h squared all over h. And then the h is Cancel. So we can get 6x add 3h. Now the derivative gives the limit as h tends to 0. Of 6x add 3h. Now, as h tends to 0, six 
Well, the 3H is also just going to tend to 0. So 6X add 3H tends to 6X. Therefore, DF by DX does indeed equal 6X. Okay, then number two, exactly the same, except this time we're doing it with x cubed. So, the left f of x equal x cubed. Then f of x plus h is going to be x plus h all cubed. Okay, now we need to expand that, so a little bit of binomial expansion. I'm going to use Pascal's triangle to get the coefficients. So with a power of 3, we want row 3. So top is the 0 row then 1, 1, then 1, 2, 1, and then 1, 3, 3, 1. So this is going to be a 1 times x cubed add 3 x squared h to the power of 1 add 3xh squared add h cubed alright now we can start putting the fraction together so We're going to get then x cubed, add 3x squared h, add 3x h squared, add h cubed, minus x cubed. all over h. Now the x cubed cancel. So we have uh, 3x squared h. Add 3x h squared. Add h cubed all over h. So then the h's can cancel. So we get 3x squared plus 3x h plus h squared. So now the derivative is the limit as h tends to zero of three x squared add three x h. Add h squared. Now, as h tends to zero, the last two terms also 
Ten to zero. And we are just gonna be left with three X squared. So TF by DX does indeed equal three X squared. Boom. Okay then guys, that's it for this set. I have a couple less straightforward first principles questions, which is going to be the next video in the playlist. Hope to see you there. Take it easy. Take care.